Well, good morning everybody. I tell you what, it's good to be out. Oh man. What a week. Uh down here at Lewstock. This is Saturday today. Down here at Lewstock. There's nobody here. I can't believe it. <laughs> there is nobody fishing at all. Whew. That seems a bit crazy, but anyway, after all these easterly winds and God knows what, today there is no wind at all. It's going to be like that all day today. Yeah. I just can't believe there's nobody here. Either I'm missing something, or they know something I don't, I don't know, but anyway. <clears throat> or are they the sensible ones? It's two degrees now. It was one and a half degrees when I got here. It's about two degrees now, so that's gone up a wee bit. <coughs> yeah. I'll tell you what, it's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. No daisy today. She was shivering her little uh, doofers off this morning. After going out in the garden, I thought, oh no, I can't take her out in that. So she's at home, in the warm, <laughs> probably where I should be. But anyway, we're out here fishing. I've just got these two rods out there now. One's got a uh, pulley, pulley, uh, pulley rig on, the other one has got a scratching rig on. Scratching rig's got ragworm, pulley's got, uh, yeah, squid, stuffed with raw prawn. Just the head part, just the juicy bit. Mmm, lovely. Yeah, well, had a nice breakfast all the way here. So I'm feeling all right. <clears throat> Bloody cold, as I've always already said. Down here on these uh, goddamn boulders. Yeah. Anyway, let's see what we can do today. Last week was a blank, total blank. I don't think anybody caught nothing at all, really. <laughs> <laughs> Mind you, to be fair, I was fishing big baits and stuff like that. I weren't going to give in to the whiting. Today I'm going to have a little bit of a playing session. I'm here for anything. So I've got small hooks on one and big hooks on the other. Let's see what happens. I shall bring you back if there's anything to report. In a bit, just for now. <coughs> right, just a little update for you. We're an hour and 25 minutes before low water now. Here at beautiful Lillstock. Had a couple of rattles on the uh, squid so far. Hmm. Let's go and have a little look here, shall we? Still plenty of these little buggers about, look. Lovely. God, there's loads of them actually. <laughs> Scattered around everywhere. And look at this. Look. Sand. Lovely. That's where we're, we should be going in a minute. Down on the sand. Yeah, look at this. Tell us, some of these are quite, uh, quite pretty looking fish. Uh, fish? <laughs> yeah. You know what I mean. A little bit muddy down here today. Got to watch where you're stepping, obviously. Yeah. Yeah. Well, there you go. Look at that. Nice bit of sand. Get all in a minute. That'll be nice. Round these, uh, round these boulders, anyway. <coughs> Makes me legs ache, these boulders do. 
Beautiful. Right up. Like I said, we're hour and 25 minutes before low water now. <clears throat> we're going to get down on the sand. Well, I'm going to get down on the sand. Yeah. I shall uh, bring you back if there's anything to report in a bit. Well, another little update for you. It's, uh, there's no water here. <laughs> oh dear. I had a gut feeling I should have gone further down uh, towards Minehead. Yeah, there you go. You live and learn. That's the trouble you see, I haven't been watching the tides, I haven't been watching what's going on, so... Oh god, that's a bit muddy. <clears throat> let's, uh, let's retreat from there. Yeah, I don't know if you can see it or not, but... Over in the bay, kind of over there. All the water's gone, the water, water line is sort of... Uh, about sort of there. So all that is empty. That's why there's nobody here. <laughs> Apart from me. Yeah, I could uh, drop the rods down and walk up around that way, I suppose, but there's only 45 minutes now to low water. So I just will uh, get on my phone, do a bit of work. Yeah, and relax for an hour or so. Ooh. I keep walking into this mud, that's not good. Okay, right, so, uh, ooh, oh my god. <clears throat> yep. We'll get back up here. Okay, so be warned when you come down here. Don't go too far out on the sand. <laughs> it's mud. <clears throat> okay, right. Yeah, there's no water here. There's no depth to it at all. So, I'm just going to leave the rods out there for a minute. And uh, relax. Do a bit of work, I suppose. Okay. I should bring you back in a, about, I don't know, hour and a half, two hours, something like that. When there's a bit more depth here. No point in packing up, moving somewhere else. I just want to stay here now. Okay, in a bit. You never guess what. Does that save a blank or is that uh, taking the mickey? <laughs> oh dear. All right, mate. Yeah. Little buggers. Yeah, it looks like there's plenty of crabs out there, doesn't it? <coughs> Worm baits are coming back strip. Anyway, um, as you can see, look, the water line's up to here now. So I'm going to move around the coast a bit. Not very far, just up there. <clears throat> yeah, I want to keep this position as the, uh, yeah, for the flooding tide. You know what I mean? Hmm. Anyway, right, I shall bring it back. <clears throat> We're going to move down there a wee bit, in a bit. All right, just a little update for you. I've moved uh, further around. Oh, <clears throat> Oh, it's hard work when the rods are set up, isn't it? <laughs> i got to show you this, look. This sea, look at it. It's as flat as a witch's tit. Unbelievably calm. I'm sure that's going to change when the tide starts ripping back in. Yeah. I've got something, to, something else to show you, look. Oh, bloody fish there. Oh. There, sir. <laughs> it's like, uh, yeah, I don't know what to call it. It's, it's kind of, uh, <laughs> yeah, not on our planet, that's for sure. Place is surrounded by it. Yeah. 
It's like a forest of this stuff is. Yeah, beautiful. Yeah, well there's a bit of the wildlife around here which is good. Oh, a couple of little fish and stuff. Good to see. Wario. I've just bunged the rods back out there. Not really much point until the tide turns. Uh, it's about 15 minutes or something like that now before low water. So uh, not long to wait. Okie dokie. I'll bring it back soon. In a bit. Well, just a quick update for you. As soon as it hit low water, it turned around. <laughs> it's on its way back in. No slack water, no nothing. Just as soon as it hit low water, boom. It's on its way back in again now, look. Yeah, that's good. Still flat as a witch's tit. But it's the right colour. Look at that. Nice, dirty, browny chocolate colour. Lovely. Just what we want. Yeah, it's coming in fast. Just had a right old belt in pull down on the left hand rod here, on squid. Yeah. Nothing come of that though. Okay, right. That's just a little update for you. We're going to be chased by the tide now for the next uh, five hours. <laughs> Lovely. Just what you want. Okay, I shall bring it back in a bit. <coughs> Does anybody know what this is? It looks like a baby soul, but I don't know. I just rebated one of the rods, and uh, this one was kind of stuck over one of the legs of the grip there. Of the grip there. You know, I don't know if you can see that too well, but uh, looks like a baby soul to me. Dear little chap. Right, let's get him back in. Yeah, anyway, as you can see, tide's well on the flood. Uh, there's a bit of a pull there at the moment, which is good. Okay, right, I shall bring it back. I'm going to get this little fellow back in, in a bit. Got a bite on the left hand rod. Look at that. Oh dear. I don't know what that is. It was a bit strange. Whatever it was, I missed it. So. Let's rebate and get them back out. Smack myself in the head then with a bloody lead. Right, I should bring it back in a bit. All right, my handsome. Well, it's about two and a half hours into the flood now. Started off pretty good as the tide turned, but um, the last sort of hour and a half, not even a rattle. Mind you, the tide's starting to pick up now, so hopefully things will uh, start improving. Mind you, we're in the Bristol Channel, aren't we? <laughs> and we're fishing, not catching. 
Ugh. God, it's getting bloody cold, I can tell you that. Hmm. I've had to put my sheepskin on. Hmm. Anyway, it won't be long before it's dark now. As you can see, light's fading pretty fast. I've got tip lights on already. Yeah. Okay, well, I should bring you back if there's anything else to report. Still nobody else fishing here, it's just me. Kind of tells you something really, doesn't it? <laughs> I must be mad. Okay, well, I should bring you back in a bit. Oh, we might have a runner. Right hand rod. He just pulled off some line. Let's, uh, let's see what he's going to do. Hope you can see it okay, it's uh, getting pretty dark so... Take it or no? Okay, right, I shall bring it back in a bit. I don't know, fish. They're so finicky, aren't they? Quite right, in a bit. Whatever that was, I dropped it. That was nice too. Bloody hell. Oh well. I think I'm going to get fishing out. <laughs> oh dear. I'm really glad to. That was a massive bait. Yeah, that's all that's left of it. Oh my god. <coughs> oh well, right. Sorry, I keep blinding you. I'll bring you back in a bit. Let's rebait.
think that's the one with the one with ragworm on. That's the first spot I've had for about an hour now. <coughs> Have to excuse me, phone pinging away in the background. <coughs> Looked like a little whiting or something, doesn't it? Mind you, we're quite close to Hinkley Point, so it could be a gigantic crab. <laughs> oh dear, oh dear. <laughs> no. Right, he's give up on that. I shall bring it back. White and rod again. snag. I'll just try and get this snag out of here. I'll back in a sec. All right, my handsomes. Well, I tell you what, it's an hour before high tide and the fishing is awful. The camera keeps uh, icing over and uh, <laughs> yeah, it's quite bizarre. Look at this. Uh, I'll try and show you. Look at that. It's uh, oh dear, it's a bit icy to say the least. Yeah, yeah, it's a bit chilly out here, <coughs> and the fish aren't playing ball tonight. Don't get me wrong, I've had a few good bites, a few good pull downs, etc., a couple of good runs, but yeah, there we are. Right, anyway. It's an hour before high water. Um, mm, I just will stay here now until high water, fish it half hour or, or an hour or so uh, after high. Then get home and have something to eat. I'm starving. <laughs> yeah. 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 Okay, right. I shall bring you back if anything else does happen. Not looking good. <laughs> it might be another blank. Right, I shall bring it back anyway. Oh, blimey. <coughs> God, I'll tell you what. That was a fight and a half. There you go, look. Nice little codling, about four pound. That was on the, uh, on the scratching rig, believe it or not. On a size two hook. <laughs> with a ragworm. Well, just shows you persistence does pay off. Let's get him off and I'll, uh, I'll show you him then. In a sec. There you go. Look. Absolute little beauty. <coughs> Alright mate, do you like my beard? <laughs> <laughs> oh dear, I'm pleased to see that when I tell you it's been a long day, a very, very long day. Rightio, <clears throat> I 
let's get him back in. I'm not going to take any more cod lids, so this one's going to go back in. A beautiful hide. Let's get him back in. I'll bring you back. Right, I think the time has come. <laughs> the pack this gear down. Yeah, tide's rushing out like a good one. It's quite funny, you know. I've had to, um, every time I put the camera on, I've got to scrape the ice off the lens. It's quite bizarre. Oh dear. Look at this. Look. I don't know where you'd be able to see it now, but it's got to be about minus two here. Yeah, it's pretty cold. Pretty cold for sure. Blimey. All over the rods. Yeah, over everything. Radio. Yeah, I think the time has come. I need to go and find myself a latte or something. Warm up a bit. <coughs> yeah, that little codlin, he was three and a half pound, we're just over three and a half pound. Yeah, nice little chap. He went back in all right. Took a little bit of uh, time to get him to revive, but yeah, he went off all right anyway, which is good. Okie dokie. I'm off. I hope everybody's had a good uh, good week, etc., etc. And uh, hopefully those that have been out fishing have caught something. Fishing is hard at the moment in the Bristol Channel, that's for sure. Yes. Anyway, I haven't blanked, which is great. I'm going to get on home. Get home in the warm. Take care all. Have a good weekend. If you're fishing tomorrow, good luck. And we'll see you again, I don't know, maybe even with during the week. More than likely next weekend, but you never know. <clears throat> mm. We um, should be doing a session with Louise sometime uh, in the week, hopefully. Yeah. Okay, cheers all. Take care. See you soon. Bye-bye now. Cheers, me handsomes. <laughs>